Hello and welcome to this episode. In it, we will be comparing 3 inch or 76 millimeter angle grinders. A while ago, I couldn't sleep so good, so at 2 a.m., I went on AliExpress and I bought this angle grinder. Now it's here, we may as well compare it to the Parkside equivalent. The one from AliExpress with these high quality safety gloves, two batteries, included Allen key, charger, and the disc on the grinder as well as a spare disc, so two discs in total, is a brushless model and it cost me 30 euros. This one from Parkside doesn't include a charger or a battery. It's the 12 volt C2 version. It is a 12 volt brush motor and you get only an angle grinder, cutting disc and an Allen key. We will be testing with brand new cutting discs, two brand new grinding discs and these carbide multi-wheel discs and I'm eager to see what they can do. Four fully charged batteries, two for each, just in case one of them runs out. Let's verify that. There you have it. All have more than 12 volts in them. Just a simple on and off button on each. You can't select the speed. On the Parkside version, in order to cut, you need to press in and hold the button. Otherwise it disengages, which for a little cut would be very convenient. However, if you want to cut something for quite a long time, it could become an inconvenience. With the AliExpress version, you just press it in and then it stays on like that. And then a little click and it disengages. You can change the position of this protective cover on the AliExpress version and on the Parkside version. As you can see, first differences come up here. This one has a very nice clicking sound and very nice feedback. Whereas here, nothing of the sort. Noise test. So it turns out both are around a 90 decibel mark, as near as makes no difference. Weight with a cutting disc and the included battery, 680 grams, 927 grams. However, the Parkside version feels a lot better built than the AliExpress version. Let's see if we can verify the RPM claims. The AliExpress mini angle grinder claims 19,500 RPM. So about 4,500 RPM less than the claim. The claim with Parkside is 19,000 RPM. So only 1,500 RPM off the claim. This is very close. This one is very far off. And now time to test them out. 76 millimeter cutting disc, same disc in both tools. We have titanium, aluminium, brass and steel. These are six millimeter rods and a two millimeter thick piece of steel. And we will go on to bigger and better rods and pieces. So it appears this one is dead already. Let's try the other battery. Okay, new battery going in. Can we get through a six millimeter aluminium rod with a brand new brushless AliExpress angle grinder? Moving on to brass, six millimeter diameter.
a titanium rod. 6 mm diameter. Finally, I've got there. Park side. stainless steel and a great opportunity to try the gloves that came with this angle grinder. And now the time has come to test out these carbide cutting wheels. Brand new 2 amp battery in the bark side and a third brand new battery in the AliExpress tool. So on them, they say wood, plastic, wood nails, and plaster. This is a plastic pipe. Let's see how they do. brand new grinding disc in each and let's see how much material we can remove from this metal in 10 seconds So there you have it. This is actually quite a nice tool. However, holding this in to keep it running could be quite strenuous on the thumb. The AliExpress version is completely useless apart from the easiest tasks which you can do with a saw blade and your muscle strength. However, a carbide multi-wheel is a nice surprise for wood and for plastic. At least the gloves lasted. <laughs>